All right, YouTubers, uh, Talon. Here's the Talon, uh, Talon with that J Concepts body. I did an orange, black. And instead of just on the last one, I just did the inside. I did the outside rim on these ones. Kept the windows clear. Stickers. I don't know about the lighting in here. I'll probably have to do this tomorrow outside or something. It's been raining. But, um, yeah, it works perfect. This will, I don't know if this will help. Yeah, the J Concept stickers are way better for the windows. But, uh, and there's that, all that light on it. I don't know what's going to come out like. Um, the shocks, uh, instead of keeping them red, and this front that's low, it's going to get the T-bone bumper or the, um, whatever that other company is. It has a bumper now. So, came out sweet though, but the body fits freaking perfect, dude. It fits perfect. It goes right with the wheels. See the cutouts for the wheels? So, um, yeah, so this is the same body that I had on the uh, Mugen. It's a Mugen um, MBX6T body. So, uh, the only thing I did, like I said, these are the Pro Line clips. Gives you little rubber tabs, uh, body clips. They're really nice. I got them for all my vehicles now. Made sure I put the little American flag. Freaking tight. The body post extensions um, for the outcasts. And the other posts would have worked perfect, but I only had one, and they're discontinued. So if you use the other post, it just has this, and this is just a, a carbon washer that I painted black. It's a fiberboard or whatever, but yeah, it's the, it's on there tight. Just these regular posts for the Outcast or the Nero or the Big Rock or whatever and I had some new body mounts here so I put them on it's got the hot racing front and back towers the Savox this, that's still the Savox that uh, I originally put when I got it so they do hold up a lot it doesn't have the servo um, plate on this one and um, the hot racing's motor mount this all got redone when um, I did that big old crash. So these are um, Nero um, shocks, front Nero shocks. So that's it, and I put the um, back flip tires on. And somebody post uh, asked me, you know, they heard J these J Concept bodies are a lot thinner. Um, they are. They're a lot thinner than Proline, and they're a lot thinner than uh, the Talon, but that doesn't mean that it's not going to hold up, you know what I mean? It could be a totally different kind of plastic, whatever they use, and um, I did the front different than my other one. I did the front um, headlights and grill different, because... They give you different options on the sticker sheets on what you want to go with. 
and then uh, just the little headlight things that are left. But um, it's a big, big, big difference because it's got this bump up, so you ain't going to have that ripping through. Plus, my Gorilla Tape is folded in there, plus another piece on top, so that's really thick. And then I have the Gorilla Tape here, and then another one, so there's two layers. But yeah, you Gorilla Tape the shit out of it, and um, use a hair dryer, and it melts all that glue, and makes it warm. Um, obviously, I couldn't do the windows, because I kept them clear, but... Uh, put little patches, you know, doubling up where the stress stress points are. So, other than that, it's beast. We'll see how it holds up. All I know is um, I'm tired of uh, going through them other bodies. I mean, they crack up real easy. And I don't have my tower to tower brace, as you see. Um, as of now, but it will be on there before it gets bashed. Yeah, so you just tilt it on there, pop it down, pop it down there, bam. Beautiful, beautiful thing. Alright, YouTubers, I'm out.